Hay Group research shows that as much as 20% of a typical workforce may be frustrated. There are two important implications of this for organizations. First, organizations are leaving performance on the table. Organizations have these employees where they want them from a motivational perspective. These employees are motivated to perform well and want to make strong contributions. But due to barriers, they are not able to do so. Secondly, organizations have limited time to act. Why is that? Because frustrated employees are unlikely to remain in that state for the long term. There are three possible courses of action that frustrated employees take. One, a breakthrough. Certainly some employees will problem solve their way around barriers in the workplace and become more effective over time. Secondly, a breakdown. There will, however, be a large group of employees that over time will withdraw their motivation, leading to only a larger pool of disengaged employees. And third, a clean break. There will be a large group of employees suffering from frustration who will simply exit the organization to find better situations. The clean break option is particularly likely for high performers and high potentials. Why? Quite simply, because they have options elsewhere. The result of this is that organizations lose some of their most valuable people.